Hi everyone, it's Tiffany. I'm back in The Sims 4 and we are here with another kit overview. Two kits were released today at the time of me filming this. We had the poolside splash kit, which I already filmed a video on. Make sure you check that video out if you're interested. Um, that was a create a sim kit. And then we are here now with the Sims 4 modern Lux kit, which is a build by kit. Oh, I'm always here for the build by kits. I love it. So I love the look of it so far. I know there was a little bit of a teaser released or somebody leaked something or whatever. I didn't get to see it yet. So I don't know what items we have other than what I'm seeing a little bit of in the preview screen. Uh, it says right here, bedroom bliss design, a stylish and inviting space with high end pieces like a lavish bed with a tuft headboard, a vanity, a plush rug, and other decadent details. And then we have signs of, of success. Upgrade your lifestyle with a little extravagance. Make a statement with luxury items like a TV disguised as wall art. Excuse me? Designer handbags, sculptures, and a functional record player. I'm sorry. What? A TV disguised as wall art. Um, well, that's already worth this kit. Uh, so let's jump into it and see what we've got. Let's, well, we have, we have a pre-designed room here, which I kind of want to look at just briefly, just briefly, just look at it really quickly. Ooh, super cute. All right. Now let's go into all of the objects, just all of them. And then we will filter through packs. I mean, it's obvious which ones are in the pack because they're new. <laughs> they have little stars on them. But by the way, we have new pack filters. It came in a patch earlier this week. I am so excited. All right, modern looks. Whoops, I feel like I should build a wall first. That would probably be better. Let me, let me, let me build a wall really quickly just so we have it, you know? Uh, will there be doors or anything? I don't think so. You never know though, right? They surprise me every time. Okay, so here we are. Here we are. I feel like I should throw in a window. Should we throw in a window? Because I'm seeing, I'm seeing curtains. Let's, sorry, one more go. Um, let's get just some quick windows. I don't know. I just need quick windows, somebody. Well, let's go, um, oops, sorry, tall walls and like big windows. I'm just gonna do this and we're gonna, we're gonna check out the curtains. I don't know, we'll, we'll figure it out. Okay, sorry. That was a little bit of a side quest there. Um, we're gonna continue filtering modern Lux. I think I'm actually gonna start with the curtains just because I have the windows here and I made a big deal out of it. <laughs> so we have a legendary curtain left. Okay, so they are not for tall windows. <laughs> But here we go. Let's look through these. They are great plain swatches. I will use these so much. I'm excited for that. And then we have the right version of that. And then they snap together very nicely. I feel like I need to get different, <laughs> different, different windows. Um, anyway, we could just space them out so that, could I, I can't, I, oops, that's not what I wanted to do. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna scoot this in like that. Perfect. All right, I think these are taller. Yes, okay, perfect. So let's go through the same, they're the same swatches, honestly. Um, it looks great, I'm excited for it. I'm gonna do the pink and then the other side, let's do the gray. It looks so good, I am stoked. I love some curtains, especially plain colored curtains. I think honestly, only like complaint, if we will, I want more colors. I want more colors. Um, I don't think there's more curtains, so I'm gonna just get rid of that window. So let's start, shall we start over here? We've got a legendary curtain rod. Hmm, okay, so you could use this for any of your curtains. Oh, or you could use it as an extender. Here we go, exactly my problem from before. Look at that, oh! Like, are you for real? Are you for, I'm gonna keep it that color so you can see that it's a different item, but. Look at all of these, look at all of these options. Oh, oh, that's amazing. All right, I've already been one over. I'm, I, I got one over in the very beginning, so <laughs> I'm excited. Uh, let's go ahead and do this incline leaning mirror. This is beautiful. I love it, it's stunning. We'll look at it from the side in just a second, but you can see it is just propped up against the wall. I honestly really want a large leaning mirror for myself personally, 
in real life because I want to, I just, I just want one like, just like that. Perfect. Uh, so we have the moment. Is this the TV? I don't think this is the TV. This is just a picture which stunning. Love it. Love the look of it. Oh, look at the perfume bottle. Ooh, so good. There's so many good options. I like the perfume bottle, but that's great. And then, oh, we've got a plant. You guys don't even know my excitement with plants. I mean, look at it with this. This is such a cute little setup. Hold on. Okay. Let's look at the swatches. Yes, love it. Living for it. I'm going to keep it in this swatch. And it's like, well, I don't have build, um, I'm sorry, uh, move objects on or anything, but like, this is the cutest, isn't it? Just like the little setup. Oh my gosh. All right. I'm going to like skip over here so I can put some of these against the wall, but we have a bed, a beautiful bed with the like plush headboard. I think it's beautiful. It's stunning. It comes in a lot of different colors. Honestly though, I don't know. It looks a little, um, What's, what am I trying to say? Like the colors, I feel like I always complain about the color swatches just not matching or being weird, but I do, I would like to see maybe like a pattern on the blanket instead of the same colored blanket. I don't know. That's just being picky. I think it's cute. I think if there were more swatches, I'd be happier, but I'm, I'm, I'm just nitpicking now because I already love this pack. All right. We've got this really pretty chair that will match our, our bed. I don't really want to, should I, should I just go with matching? I think we need a pink one. And then we've got this chair. So it has the same swatches. Really cute. And then, ooh, is that like, is it a special chair? I feel like it's pretty low to the ground. Maybe it just has a low back. So then we have a so chic end table. Oh, it looks so good. I hope there's like just an all black or all white. Okay, there's an all white and an all black. Oh, and this one's beautiful. Okay, next we have a wall shelf. Oh, look at that. It's glass and it has this, oh, it looks so good. And it has black and white and gold and silver. Oh my gosh, I it wins. All right, next up we have a vanity. I love the vanity. I love, mostly because I love that mirror attached to it. It just looks really, really good. Um, I'm assuming we're having the same swatches. It just matches, which rightfully so. I like the, the this one a lot. It's just very, very nice and elegant. So that's already the first, almost the first layer here. But we've got this little, what is this? Just a plaque, they call it. It's really cute though. It's definitely something I'll use for decoration. And then we've got this muse on a shelf. So it is a, just like a, just a head. Got lots of different art styles on it though. That's cool. And you even can have plain ones. Where's that plain one? That, that one and that one. So that's really, really cool. And then we've got a pillow, but like, what do we do with it? <laughs> like we're putting it on a table. Like, can we do something fun with it? Or is it just going to sit there? Uh, show stopping, of course, final touch to any room. I mean, I, I like to just lay pillows around in my builds and stuff, but it just seems like it's way too upright. Is it just me? I don't know. Like I said, I'm nitpicking now, but that is a little kind of, kind of weird, but I love the swatches on it. So stunning. I just like, I don't know. Maybe we, is there a couch we could put it on or like, what do we do? We could set it on the vanity. And I'm sure we could be able to set it on the shelf if we wanted to. But yeah, if we had to move objects or something and you like put it here, I would get it. But I don't know. I don't know about that. And then we've got the baddies bag. Of course, that's going to go on the vanity. Let's take a look at the swatches. Beautiful, elegant, stunning. We've got this intersections rug. Oh, it's a rug. Oh, yes. Any rug, any day. I am a sucker for the rugs. <gasps> ooh, ooh, oh, that's beautiful. All right, hold on. Oh, these are great. These are good. I'm gonna use these a lot. These are so beautiful. I'm especially excited about that one. Okay, we've got a lamp. Got lots of, this is, this is some good stuff, guys. Good stuff. All right, so we've got a lamp, same swatch style. Um, and then we've got, oh, we've got lighting. I'm gonna just put move objects on. So I can just kind of have them out. 
So we've got this beautiful light fixture. I will probably use this a lot too. It's just so pretty. And then I guess a lower hanging one, of course. And then, oh, this is the art frame TV. Let's read about this for a second. Okay, so uh, transform your home into a gallery with the art frame TV. This flat screen TV is disguised as a framed picture piece of art when turned off and becomes an incredible display of entertainment when turned on. Now you could truly have the best of both worlds. That's so good. Oh my gosh. I need already need more swatches in this. So it's shaped like a picture frame. It looks like a picture frame. Look at that. That's such a beautiful, and it has very generic pictures and it has very generic frames. Like, look, this black and white, I like it. So I'll be able to use this quite a bit. The pictures though, like I said, I would love to see more swatches, more pictures, just because I want to be able to put this in every single room, um, no matter what, <laughs> but like so pretty. I love it. And then we've got a uh, record player, which it has a power consumption rating. So I guess it's gonna act like a radio kind of thing. So that's really cool. It looks stunning too. Let's go ahead and look through those swatches. I love it. It looks so good. And then we've got a bookcase. Of course, the room is not complete without a bookcase. Look at this. It looks so elegant and so good. Oh, stunning. I'm obsessed. And then there's only one more item, but it completes us. We've got the dresser. And of course the same swatches, but super stoked for all of the stuff. I kind of want to change it all to the same swatch right now. I don't know. I'm, I just, I really like this, this, this swatch for some reason, but it's so exciting. I am thrilled. Like these items are so great. And these are items that I'm going to use every single build. I promise I'll use that, this and this a lot. I'll use the TV now, the light fixtures. It just looks really good. I can't wait to do a, a specific room on these. This is going to be great. I would love to hear your opinion on this though. Do you love it? Do you hate it? I know kits have been hit or miss with a lot of people. I I own I honestly don't own some kits, mostly create some kits because I don't use them a lot. I am very excited for this pack. I've been excited for a lot of the build by packs. It's just adding so much content for me to be able to build with so many options. Like I'm stoked for this rug. I'm stoked to just make a bedroom with all of this stuff. It's going to be amazing. But anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.